Welcome back to another edition of The Flufferdome. As you can see, I'm not in my normal space today. I'm in my closet. Guess what? Because I'm going to do a closet tour. So, that's what we're going to do. But before we get to that, let's just do a little housekeeping. If you are not subscribed, make sure you subscribe and activate the bell. So that way you can get notifications when I upload. Which should be every Saturday. I'm getting back in my normal schedule. So expect content from me on Saturdays. Ching! Also, make sure you are also following me on my social medias. You know, the Instagram, I'm always there if you're looking for something fun and interesting and just wondering what I'm doing during the week and not, you know, when I'm not making videos for you guys. Check me out on Instagram at the underscore Flufferdome. Same as my YouTube name. Okay, so, anywho, just want to thank all you guys for subscribing, you know, and do this long-awaited wardrobe tour. People have been asking me. I don't have a big, giant wardrobe, um, especially, like, lately of late. You've been seeing a lot of my dresses, like, repeatedly because I don't have a whole lot. But I'm going to go through what I have, um, you know, just so you guys know. Okay? So, let us start with bloomers. <laughs> so, I have three pairs of bloomers. One I'm wearing right now, so you can't see them. They're my long white ones. Oop. <laughs> yeah, so they're just long white. They have a little frilly. I'll probably insert a picture or something, you know, whatever, so you can see. And then I have these, like, really short, terrible ones. These are, like, the worst bloomers, but they are really good for, like, when I wear really short things. Okay. And then, you know what? Actually, pause. Yeah, yeah, no. We're, this is what we're doing. And then I have these black ones. These. Doo -doo -doo. Love those. Those are like my second favorite. I, I have another pair of bloomers. I have four pairs of bloomers. The other one, they're black with white um, cotton lace on the, on the, um, around the legs. Um, I believe those are still downstairs hanging up. I thought I collected all my things to put them away so that way I could do this for you because, you know, everything's clean and put away except for what I'm wearing. And I forgot those. So, whatever. So that's all my bloomers, okay? Um, next we have, uh, Peignoirs. So I have this one. This is thrifted. This is nice. I got this at the thrift store. I haven't worn it yet because of the color. It doesn't go with any of my... Lolita, I have worn it with other J Fashion stuff, but you know. Then I have this one, which I have also worn with other J Fashion stuff. I don't know if this is technically a Peignoir. This is like a house dress thing, but I have worn this with other J Fashion stuff. I love this. It's just very old and, you know. And then this one, this pink one, is my favorite. You have seen this. I have worn this recently as well as in the past. Like, this one is just... I love this one. I found this at a thrift store also. Love this. Okay. So I'm going to try to be kind of quick because I don't want this to be too long. This is a Bolero. This is just some random off-brand Bolero that I just had. I think this is actually a children, <laughs> children's size because it says 16 on there. But, like, that's, yeah, it fits. I haven't worn it yet because it doesn't really go with anything of, you know, whatever. I don't know. But it's there. If I ever need it. This is also a bolero. This one is a Taobao bolero. Um, one of those hooded, like, kind of Parker-like ones. I really like this one. You have seen this one. I've worn it a couple times. Okay. All right. That is it for boleros. This is a cardigan. This is a Baby to Star Shine Bright cardigan I'm wearing. This has this, uh, this is the ribbon, ribbon, ribbon. Oh, this one coming untied. Okay. Um, wow. Okay. Next we got blouses and cutsos. So let's do these cutsos first. These are, this is Baby the Starshine Bright. Uh, yeah, there it goes. This is Baby. Love this one. This was my, this was my first cutso. I got that. Love it. Cute. I've worn that. You've seen it before. This you've seen a lot. This is Angelic Pretty. Um, this is one of my other favorite cut sews, especially when I'm doing like darker looks. I love this collar. Like look, look at that. Look at the, 
AP. I can't get too close because my um, phone, um, I'm pretty sure my phone is dying. So yeah, so the, the, the focus doesn't work very well. Waiting to get a new phone, that will happen. All right, here is a blouse. This is just, um, I don't know, I think just like a tab. Oh no, it has a name on it. Advertising Balloon. It's the brand. This, I'm pretty sure it's Tabo though, but this ties in a bow there, this nice velvet ribbon, and the little polka dots, they're hearts, they're not polka dots. It's so cute. I love this. Haven't worn it yet. This is originally what I was supposed to wear with my dream dress for my birthday cord, but it rained and I had to change that whole cord up. I made a whole post about it. Um, then I have these. This is just, you know, just like this mesh. They also have little hearts on it, little blouse. I have that also in black. And then I have this white one with these black polka dots. And they are flocked. These little polka dots, they're flocked. They're just not like tiny dots on the, it's like gauzy material like that. Then I have these two. These are my first blouses. I believe, I wanna say I got these from eBay. I know, I know, leave me alone. Um, but yeah, these are my first blouses, which are like my favorite. They're cropped. They're great for the summer. They're this nice, nice material. Love these. Favorite blouses. I got to get more of these and more colors. Um, yeah. This isn't technically a blouse or mine. This is my husband's shirt. This is the, the matching shirt to the dress I have. And I just keep it in my stuff because, you know, I like it there. <laughs> Um, next I have uh, these body line blouses uh, this lavender one I'm wearing the heart blouse with the heart buttons and the pearls and then I have it also in white love that then I have this pink ribbon one yes that and then I have this one this is the bunny ears one which i haven't worn it yet because i just can't i don't know i just don't know his bunny ears bunnies are not my theme my theme is bears if i do any animal you know even though i do have a bunny this is just one bunny piece and one cat piece just from body line that aren't lolita like this one here I love this it's so comfortable i just put it on my girl because this was on her before and i took this off and then she was naked so had to put clothes on her i can't have her in the background just being naked that's just rude um <laughs> just rude next i have this Taobao blouse i got secondhand on lace market this is really nice only thing i don't like about this blouse is it bleeds like really really bad like I wash all of my solid black stuff together just because if anything bleeds, I'm not worried about it, you know, messing up any print or any like um, opposing color lace trim or anything like that. But this one is just this classic fashion, vo not even Vogue, it's like Vasu, I don't know. It's Taobao, you know, and it has corset lacing in the back. I really like it, it's really comfy. Um, it's my only long sleeve blouse besides for those sheer ones and that lace AP cut. So, okay, that's it for blouses. Okay, next I have, so I'm going to get into my dresses. I'm going to start with brand and then we have towel bow and then I have body line. Okay. All right. First, this one, this is angelic, pretty fr frilly ruffle, frilly ruffle, I believe. Fluffy ruffle? It's either frilly or fluffy ruffle. I don't remember. But it's one of those halter neck ones, hence how I have it on the hanger. I love this one. This one has so much poof. Like it has, it's AP, you know, and it's not like a lucky pack dress. So it has this um, built in petticoat, this built in tool in there that helps just makes it so much more big. And I like big. <laughs> I like a big and poofy. I love it. This, I love this dress. Cool. 
that is AP that I have. This is AP Letter Doll. This I got at a swap and sale we did for uh, my local com. Did for um, ILD last, last summer. I'm trying to show you it has pockets, but my rings, I can't fit my hands in the pocket. But yes, it has pockets on both sides. I love this so much. It's so comfortable and so cute. I love wearing it. Mm -hmm. That, and look at these little ties. Look at the, and then the inside of the hood is lined with this lace. I love it. Cute. Okay. So that's it for my AP dresses. Next, I have baby. I have two baby dresses. Of course, my dream dress. Dancing baby bears. Uh, love this. Love this. Love the bears. Like, let me find a... I don't know if you can see it. But look. Look at the little blip. The little tongue just sticking out. So cute. I love these bears. This dress is so comfy. It has the shirring in the back. So, it, like, it stretches. It's so stretchy. And then... Ah! Okay. <laughs> okay, I'm all caught up. I'm fine, all right? So yeah, this is great. The one thing I didn't realize about this was it does not have waist ties, which is a good thing because I always have to fumble. Like this one has detachable waist ties. You can't see it. But luckily like it's detachable, so I tie it in the front and then put it back on in the back. <laughs> yes, okay, that's that baby dress. This is my other baby dress. This is, um, Pony, Pony and Dream. I, I know the name of this one. I don't know. This is Pony and Dream. That's not the full name. I will, yeah. I love this dress. I love the print. Is it Dancing Pony and Dream? It might be Dancing Pony and Dream. I don't know. The dancing. I think that's why I'm confused because Dancing Baby Bears and then Dancing Pony and Dream. Maybe. I don't know. But this is the gingham cut. I like it because it has the gingham trim and the bows. And then this is like my favorite thing that Baby does is this little dangle there. I love it. Love this dress. And this dress, I've actually broken the zipper. So, yeah. It's exposed. The insides are exposed. Excuse the exposure. Excuse it. All right. And then this dress is Meta. This is my only Meta dress. This is my first brand dress. This is Swan Garden. And that's it for my brand dresses. Next, we have this and Romeo JSK. This is like Gothic Cute or something like that it's called. Like it. This dress gets ginormous. It gets so big, and I love it. Last time I wore it, well, the only time I wore it, first time I wore it, I did that photo shoot. I posted on my Instagram that self photo shoot. I went out, running around the square like a crazy person with my tripod, taking my own pictures. Yeah, I'm that kind of little later. <laughs> but um, yeah, and I didn't wear it with as much poof as it goes, but this thing gets big. Like, I mean, look at all that material. I love it so much. I can't wait to wear it big and giant. You know, it's full. It's full regalia. All right. Next, I have Taobao. Taobao stuff. This is a uh, falling ribbon. I forget. I don't remember. Um, it's it's a Taobao after midnight is the brand. And this goes with that shirt I showed you. This one also has a pocket. You know, I got the waist ties hanging out in there because I washed it and it's just been hanging up since. Love the detail. The bow's falling. It's just so cute. It is one of those, like, sack dresses, but it looks really good. I really like it. So one of my favorite dresses. One of my favorite cords, actually. All right. Next is, is Souffle Song, right? Yeah. This is Souffle Song. This is one of the Vanitas Jazz K, I believe it's called, with this print. It's like, um... I love this so much only thing is I hate the bodice on this dress and then actually I tried to wear it the other day I like that I just keep talking through the space in the hanger <laughs> so you can see the so <laughs> so I like this dress 
but the bodice is actually crooked. It's sewed on crooked. So I'm actually gonna detach it and I'm gonna turn this into a skirt and add some frills at the bottom because I don't like how it's plain at the bottom. I don't like that. So we're gonna modify this. Just don't know when. Don't know if I'm gonna do it or if I'm going to take it to get it professionally done by the seamstress. I'm not sure yet, but that will be done because I love that print and I wanna wear it. Next, this is also souffle song. This is another one of those, um, ugh, I can't remember what this is called. But only thing I don't like is this is not detachable. So like it gets in the way of the print. So last time I wore it, I actually just like brought it around my waist like a belt and it gives it a little different look and I just tucked it into the waist ties that were tied. Cause you know, I was just in the house. I wasn't going anywhere. If I was going somewhere, I would definitely secure it. So that way, you know, but I mean, it's nice either way. Bow, bow, bow. All right. Tao Bao, Lemon Honey. This is, the brand is Lemon Honey. That's the brand for this dress. And this is Ice, Ice Lemon Soda in black. This came out last year when all the other brands were dropping, when they, uh, the Fruity Lemon and the, um, the other one, I don't know, Baby and AP had dropped their lemon dresses around the same time. And then this came out. It didn't arrive until October though, <laughs> but I love it. I love, love, love it. Can't wait till summertime to wear it again. All right, next, da, 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 da. this is Easter Mori Nameless Poem. I got this in January, finally got it, brand new. There was an order. Um, I put it in through Claba because Easton Mori did a another release. I don't know if it was advertised on um, Taobao, like on their site. I believe Claba um, had just requested, like I guess they were getting a lot of requests for it. So they asked about it and we got it. We got dresses. And this one has the, the crosses at the bottom. And these crosses are actually silver. They're not white. I always thought they were white crosses, but they're silver. Love it. Look at the look at the detail on it. And here's the back. There's no shirring, but this is an extra large. Yeah, this is an extra large, so it fits very comfortably. I have space. Uh, okay. That's it for Taobao. Then I have this one off-brand punk jazz K. I don't know. I got this second hand on Lace Market. Um this comes from my other body line piece. Don't pay that any attention. Um, this, I got this on Lace Market secondhand and it didn't have a name. Eesh. Eesh. Sorry, I should have put this in before I did this, but it didn't have a name. The seller uh, is just no name. She doesn't remember, she didn't remember where it came from or anything but i keep getting these hangers caught in my hair Urgh. okay yeah and i just love it so much you've seen me wear this several times um it's no shirring this is a very snug fit i have to be quite careful of how i wear this dress this dress also came with a, a chain that goes from here onto the belt i think i don't remember where it attaches Oh, it attaches on the side. So it goes from there over there. It has a chain. I just have it on the side. I didn't put it on. Because I think I was wearing that chain with something else. So I didn't put it back. But there's that one. Then next, we have Bodyline. This is the Bodyline... <sighs> something Heart. Something Heart Love JSK. This is all shirt here. Then there's shirring in the back here. This dress is also so very comfy. I haven't worn it in a while. I should do a cord with this. Um, some of my earlier cords, um, if you scroll back, like in my Instagram, you'll see me. I have this dress on and I like it. It's cute, 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 cute. Um, next, I have Rose Bouquet. This is Bodyline Rose Bouquet. This is a low waist. Um, I really usually, this is the only low waist I have because I have a shorter torso. So like, I feel like the low waist like gives me an odd shape, but I really like this dress though. 
I did have to get it altered. You see this little panel here? Because even though the dress itself is like a, a 3L or 4L or something, I don't know. The dress is huge. Like, look at that. The armholes were so small. Like, I had to, I couldn't get my arm in it in order to zip because it's a back zip. So I couldn't get my arm in it in order to zip it up because it like the, they wouldn't go past like there. So I got this little panel. I would took it to the seamstress and she like put this little black triangle here on both sleeves. Like, and it's, you don't even notice it. This is like one of the best modifications, the best modifications. Like if you have problems with sleeves, not fitting arms, cause I have chunky arms, you know, just take it to a seamstress, ask them to put in a little panel on your sleeve. It works, it helps. And it's underneath, you can't even see it. Love it, love that. Guess what's next? Squirrel party! Dun, 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 dun. Yeah. So I got this last summer, right when, um, uh, I believe when Bodyline like first switched over to their new, their new, um, management or ownership or whatever and they had restocked i got this then look at the swirl look at it and it is not the backwards print it is forwards um it is backwards on the bodice somewhere um i believe i showed that in my unboxing when i unboxed these last year right i did this on an unboxing i forgot I forgot about that but it's just it's just so cute look at it love this print so much <sighs> the bottom line um already showed you this one on her this is not lolita but it's really cute it was one of the other things that they released in the summertime and this is so heavy material i'm like why would y'all release this in the summer it's hot i can't wear this now so i had to wait till it cooled off to wear it these tie up in little bows i like that detail this comes off this is detachable <laughs> And um, on this one, this has like a, a lace collar that is also detachable. And um, so I can swap, you know, or just wear it without the collar. I love the shape on this. Like this gives me the cutest little shape. If you look on my Instagram, I have it posted, me wearing it. Okay, so that's that. Ah. Okay, next I have some skirts. This is body line, just this bow skirt. Um, this one is really short on me. <laughs> um, I use it for more casual cords um, cause it's really, it's it's quite short. Like you can kind of see it just like, it's, it's really short, it's a little, but I like it. I like it. And it's my only, well, what it was my first solid black skirt. This is soft cream and this is the second lolita piece i ever purchased um, the first one was body line fruit tart or something like that um that was too small i sold it i got rid of it this i love this love this look at it so pretty my first my first lolita cord was with this dress first cord this dress I put the waist bow in my hair. <laughs> yeah. All right. Next, I have I have two body line two sets. So this one is this punk set. If you look back, uh, back in November was the last time I wore this. Actually, it was for Anime Week in Atlanta convention, and I did a really cool punk cord with this. This set is it's four clothing pieces, and it comes with a bunch of. Um, like on the bottom here, there are these little crosses and that chain that you saw, that cross chain that you saw on the, that punk dress I pulled out, that goes to this. It goes across here. Yeah, it goes across there. And what I like about this is it has like a very asymmetrical design. You can kind of see it there. It's kind of asymmetrical. It's not straight across. I really like it. I want to I want to see if I find it in pink one day. But that that's a 4L. That's actually kind of big on me. I would have rather that in a smaller in a smaller size, but you know, get what's available. Make it work. 
And then this one, this I actually, <laughs> I bought this on an accident. Um, don't be on lace market scrolling half sleep. You'll buy something by accident. I did. It was this, which I don't mind. I just really haven't figured out how to wear it. Um, I have courted it one time, kind of. Um, and it was literally like I redid the basic cord in the ad just to do like an old school for some some uh, challenge I was trying to do. So I did old school cord. This skirt, this is high-waisted skirt. This also come with a beret and a bunch of bows. See, it still's got the tag on it. <laughs> this is a 2L. It's kind of small, especially the um, the coat, bolero coat thing. It's really heavy wool, so you definitely wear this like in the fall, winter. You can't wear this in the summer, especially here in Georgia. It's just it's just way too hot. But I do like it. I like the detail. I like the succinct black and whiteness of it. You know, I like it. It's nice. I'm gonna wear it again soon. I just gotta get some more like old school looking stuff. Some other stuff to quarter it with, you know? That's like the problem I'm having with a lot of my dresses because I don't have anything to quarter it with. And then this last dress, I'm not gonna show you that dress cause it's not Lolita, I just have it here. Um, I believe it's, I believe it's a square dancing dress but I like it, I use it for other fashions, not Lolita. But yeah, and that is all of my clothes. Um, you guys want to see underneath here where I have my accessories and shoes and stuff we can do that okay I'll be right okay. back so actually before we go down and look at those items there I'm gonna show you up top here and this is where I have my purses so I'm not gonna pull them down but that's just a regular like sack purse and then there is some stuff up there don't mind the hangers I'm gonna reorganize that later it's just because I just showed you guys everything, so everything's all off. But yeah, all my purses I have up here. And then here is my cotton candy feet, um, the bubble heart purse. That's what's in there, the black one. This, I have my Meta um, swan bag. It's white with the gold swans on it. Um, this is just a random bag I got at a store. These two are like my favorite bags to use. I wish I had a black one, but I guess I got the big bubble heart bag, so it's fine. They're heart shaped. Uh, yeah. Really cool. Like those. Like those. And there's. Oh! They tried to escape. Get in there, you. Yeah. So, yeah. So those are those. And then let's go down here. Okay. Hi, welcome to the floor. Um, so, it's Kumia. <laughs> okay, so here I am, and I keep my socks and hair bows in these containers here. And I got these. I got these at like TJ Maxx or something. I've seen they actually carry these at Daiso because I want more, but we don't have Daiso here in Georgia because we're lame. So I have to wait to get to a Daiso so I could buy more of these because literally this is all TJ Maxx had that day, these three. So, so here I have my head bows all lined up. I have brand and then Taobao, brand byline Taobao, and then just, you know, like indie brands like this Corona Rosada one. Um, in the front, I have uh, my rectangle headpieces and wrist cuffs stacked up there in the front. Okay. Next, I have socks. So I've got these striped socks. I'm missing the pink ones. They are actually drying. I washed them and I didn't put them up yet. Um, then all my ankle socks. These little like lacy looking. Here, I'll just pull one out and show you. Da, 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 da. these socks I have these in all the colors um, da, da, da. then I just have some random other long socks there next I have my OTKs you can see it's a bunch of black <laughs> I got two pairs of this one because I bought one pair and then I got 
another pair in a lucky pack and it was just like well now I have two pairs of the same sock I guess um so yeah and you guys have seen my socks in my wardrobe post but you know I'm not gonna pull them out again you can kind of look here these are dark night guardian meta dark night guardian I love these so much I I lost I lost out on the the skirt twice two times I lost out on the skirt for this print um, eventually I'll get it these are my Alice in the pirate ribbon socks and yeah and that's it for my socks that's it for my socks and my head bows in those bins there and yeah. next I have my shoes under here okay so I got these little bins from the Dollar Tree so all my shoes that fit in here like my tea parties I have these are my lavender ones these are my wine colored ones I'll show you the lavender ones these are really pale lavender they're like barely lavender they're really cool to cool tone too so and then we have my black ones just regular old tea parties I got these from AliExpress actually the drop shipping ones if you know about those these are my pink ones yeah so they came really fast I just have the four pair of those and they live right here then next I have shoes that cannot fit in the small boxes so I have sequestered some normie shoes boxes for my Lolita shoes so these I have these strappy black ones that I wear a lot um, mm. next I have oh these ones that are too small but I can't bring myself to part with them quite yet I love these so much like look at this these are angelic in print like they say a 41 but I believe that's a lie they're so small like my toes are always crumpled up <laughs> but I keep them and then oh in my demonia shoe box I put these guys I haven't worn these yet I got these from a friend dollar motion she sent me these I love these I haven't worn them yet I'm gonna wear them but they are living inside of my demonia box because I'm always wearing my demonia my Kira 08s so wearing those all the time so they're never in the box and last but not least I have my first purchase from Antina actually my first purchase from Taobao at all and it is these my giant Mondo red platforms with the detachable front bow I love these so much <sighs> I fell down in them in September and I, I fell down the stairs and I scuffed them up pretty good scuffed them pretty good but you know tis life tis life sorry if I'm off camera slightly I'm just trying to I'm trying to show you things <laughs> it's hard to show you things and be on camera at the same time Ugh. okay wow and last in this last little corner I'm not gonna pull everything out I'm just gonna kind of show you it it got kind of dark because I'm blocking the light but back here I've got my um, bonnet um, some black berets that one that goes with that body line set and I keep my wigs in here in these boxes and then in the corner just some like little baggies on my body line bags and then my kuma lives here on the floor and then whew, that's a lot okay here I got some accessories you can look at that Um, I keep my BB and B jewelry in the bags, you know, as you should. And actually, I will show you guys. Oh, excuse me. Oh, um, yeah, I'll show you guys those in a moment once I put this tripod down because I'm holding it to show you guys all of this this stuff here on the wall. Yeah. 
yeah and I have a lot more like bows and um, yeah I have a lot more bows and accessories that I keep over in cutie corner where I normally film like I have like boxes over there where I keep them and yeah I'm just trying to readjust this I'll be back in two seconds I gotta readjust this tripod so I could show you the other stuff hold on so I'm back and um so these are my two bb and b pieces the only two i own which i bought when they came to anime week in atlanta last year and i was so happy to get these because i could not get them on the site the when they were released they sold out this is the strawberry bat tart look at how sparkly i love this love this love this so much and then of course i had to have the matching uh the matching necklace so, so here is the eh, eh, here is the bat macaron necklace and hold on focus be nice it's so shiny and sparkly and it's black and red and i love it i've worn these the one time and I haven't worn them again since I really don't have much in these colors to court them with. So, yeah, I'm working on getting stuff so I can wear them again because I love them so much. I'm also working on getting some other bb and &B pieces so that way I can wear those with cords and stuff. Because I do need more accessories. Mm, sorry if I keep sniffling. My allergies are like really a pain in the butt today. And I've been sneezing all day. <laughs> all day I've been sneezing. But anyway, that is my wardrobe. Um, I guess I'll show you really quick. These are some other accessories that I have. The ones I'm wearing. These earrings. I love these earrings so much. A friend of mine made these. She has a shop. Cute Carousel. Go check it out on Etsy. Cute Carousel. She actually made me some, um, some face masks too. If you follow me on my Instagram, you've seen those face masks. Love those. Oh, my hair accessories. This is Choco Mint. This is Choco Mint. This is Cute, 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 cute Carousel. Her brand, these little two. They're like bobby pins. So, yeah. So that's my wardrobe. That's my closet tour. Um, I hope it was enjoyable. I know it was a bit messy, but, you know, I just figured we'll just get in here. And we'll do the thing, you know, we'll make it fun. <laughs> All right. So. Until next time, make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. Make sure you share, you know, share the fun. And make sure you activate that bell so you can get notified when I upload every Saturday. Times kind of vary, but definitely every Saturday. I am back. I am making stuff for you every day. Well, not every day, but every Saturday. <laughs> and yeah so that is my wardrobe thank you for watching i'll see you guys next time bye